a spinal cord injury. Happening right now in East Aurora, community leaders calling on Albany to lift the ban on Uber. This comes just days after Governor Cuomo voiced his support to bring ride sharing upstate. That rally happening at 42 North Brewing Company. That's where we find 7 Eyewitness News reporter Josh Bazaar. Josh? Well, Jeff, I'm here at 42 North Brewing Company, where a rally is actually just about to start, calling for Albany to bring ride sharing to Western New York. Now, state lawmakers, some local officials, and the public are gathering together to urge Albany to pass a bill that would allow ride sharing. Now, one lawmaker who's not at this rally, but who is also working to bring ride sharing upstate, is Chris Jacobs. In his first real move, the newly elected state senator from Buffalo is co sponsoring a bill that would legalize ride sharing across the state. It sets up the insurance and regulatory framework for the services to operate and lets the Department of Motor Vehicles determine security standards for vetting potential drivers. With the NCAA tournament returning to Buffalo in March, thousands are expected to visit the region. Jacobs thinks ride sharing will be legalized soon, but doesn't think it will happen in time for the tournament. He and other lawmakers hope some sort of compromise can be made for events that draw so many to the region. When we have these big types of events coming in, uh, we want to make sure that we're providing the amenity that people do expect. The current situation that we have with public transportation doesn't serve them properly, and it really does look bad on Western New York as a whole. Uh, so hopefully we're creating real, mo real momentum here. The governor talking about it, the state senate, now we need the assembly on board, and hopefully that means we can get it all together and get it done. Now, Jacob's bill is ready for a final vote. He says Senate leadership will make the decision when it will be brought forward for that. Now, Jacobs and officials here are both calling on the state assembly to move forward with legislation to pass ride sharing. Last year, the Senate passed a bill that would allow the ride sharing services to expand across the state, but no similar bill made it through the assembly. For now, we're live in East Aurora. Josh Bazan, 7 Eyewitness News.